Tom. Hello everybody, Tom Fox here, welcoming you back to Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we started our descent, our descent, our ascent up the Great Mila Tree. Or Mila Tree, depending on how you pronounce it. Uh, and in this episode, we're going to be continuing the fight upwards. And remember the issue I said I was having before with, uh, with that vertical line? Turns out it was because I turned arrow off. Yeah, arrow, like, Windows, uh, Windows arrow actually, you know, it's, I find it really weird how, like, Windows arrow was actually causing, you know, something to not look that great, even though it doesn't look that great. Never mind, whatever. Uh, so we got the Brady Bunch here. The only downside, of, I'd say the biggest downside of having your, uh, your troops marry is that no more kids, uh, come from the future to help you. Although, I don't think... <laughs> the, the one thing I find kind of funny, too, is that, like, they came to the, to the past all knowing each other already. Because they came back with Lucina, and it's like, oh, well, I guess now would be a good time to fall in love. Once upon a time, I was falling in love! Now I'm only falling apart! Yeah, I can say total eclipse of the heart. Uh, let's get Jerome. Let's see, are there any arches? Nope, no more arches. So let's switch to Jerome. Let's get Morgan Abziswe. Let's get Inigo und Na over here. And then we shall switch back to Inigo. And then we will bring down the axe! This is your last chance. So! So right! Take it easy! Enemy phase. Here they come! Ah. Checkmate! For my mother! Going berserk! Alright, Batman, do it! Thank you, Krom. Now, Batman, do it! He doesn't say much, does he? Ugh. Level up! This changes nothing, but it does feel good. Okay! Alright, who do we got over here? We got Miwa. Uh, I think... I think I could come over... Ah, uh, you know, I'll just smack him with a sword. God, he's... God, he's weak. Here's, oh, here's to, uh, to Kiel coming in at some point to help. Nope, no Kiel help. Kelp! That's how Kiel calls for help. And I can't hit anybody. Meanwhile, Inigo and Na will come up this way. Alongside, uh, oh, he can move. Alongside Melgin and Lucina. Let us switch to Lucina and wait, and bring forth the hammer. Who oh, haven't I moved yet? I guess I can come down here and try to get that sparkly, but I don't think I'll make it in time. Going for oh, he's got a bow out, so he can actually hit him. Ow! Going for Lawrence, the new warrior Lawrence. Oh, kill! Thank you. Kel finally helped! Ting, 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 ting. Oh. It seems I've reaped unexpected gains. Right, and they're coming for again! Boop! Smack! Aha! I call that the boop smack. Whoa! Reinforcements of the Waz! I hope the uh, objective isn't just to get the commander because I want to be the very best. Um, let's see. Is it kill the commander? Yeah, defeat commander. Um. Ah. Uh, you know what? My my uh tactician's instinct says to defeat the commander right away. But the fact that I want these people to get married says no! Says no and never, forever and never. 2076. Let's just kill this Falcon Rider with a gust of wind! 
what Lawrence is known for with his pointy hat. Not very becoming of a knight. Uh, let's bring a Nigo up here. I think in my personal file, I said I was on a Nigo and, uh, and Noir Mary. Uh, let's see. Let's come down in here. Let's switch. Now, let's keep Batman out. Minerva, must, it, must you pick up every little... Wait, what do you have there? Let me see. A rift door? What does this do? Calls a merchant to the world map. Where's very by location? Huh! So it's basically the merchant equivalent of a reeking box. I never picked one of those up before. Just to show you how much new things there are to learn in this uh, about this world. Eh, I think these they, they'll be fine. Alright, they come for... Was that a bow? Okay, short axe. I keep forgetting that some of these people may or may not have bows. Also, can't warriors use bows? <laughs> okay, Batman. Don't fight my battles. More! More reinforcements! In which case, where is... Oh, wait, they're right here. Don't mess with a bunny! Let's come over... Hither. And smack you with a bow and arrow. <laughs> oh, yarn. Oh, yarn! Alright, uh, let's go over hither. Let's get... I can't reach there. Let's switch to Severa, and I don't still have a bow that can attack them. And let's move Laurent over here. In the meantime, we have our troops being... That are currently in the, in the process of surrounding the boss. And meanwhile, uh, there's somebody I haven't used yet. Aha, Brady and Cynthia. Allow me to switch to Cynthia. Uh, and I think, yep. All right. So they're going after Laurent, whom cannot be hit and cannot be hurt. See, I knew making you a warrior was a good idea. You can't be. Thank you, Noir. Is that a bow? Short axe. Okay. <laughs> Did she hear the noise she made when she got hit? Eh! <laughs> that just sounded so funny to me. Oh, snap. Cynthia getting that. And she's currently A rank in her ability. Ah. Uh, thanks, Owain. Severa doth appreciate. I suppose this would be nothing to you, mother. Gods! Alright, and... Inbound the... Good God! More reinforcements! Alright, let's start bringing the fight to them, shall we? Switch! And let us use the axe! Bringing down the axe! And hammer! Right, and either way, the bow will do. Bow flex. <laughs> Wait, uh, one? Yarn. Oh, yarn. I better. I should probably switch to uh, to Noir at some point. Also, I should probably back off so that some of the other children can get some more experience. Because these two are already love birdie enough. They're love burbs. That's how love birdie they are. Uh, how, how's that short axe doing? That would do pretty well, actually. Griffin. Can't hit me, Griffin. That's right, I've exchanged Nerva. I traded her in a GameStop, and all I got was a Griffin in exchange. Um... You know, all these two are just, I'm gonna keep them hovering around. They're gonna keep going for... Yarn. Yarn and Noir. The enemy! Oh, they have me cornered. I've got to use a melee weapon now. That's the one bad thing about people who specifically use bows. You know, people who specifically use bows, oh, I'm using a steel sword. Well, Severus about to get something. Aha! You could not stay away from me! 
I shall now beat you with an inferior bow because I am that skilled. Bunny man ho! I've got your back. My apologies. Oh wow. <laughs> I forgot about that bowman. At least he only did 27 damage. Oh no, not the short axe. Uh, ooh. Excuse me, mind if I ax you something? Your victory is I would like to ask you a question. To your face! Alright, well, what else do we got? Uh, can they reach down there? Nope. Alright, let's come over here then. And... Let's smack at you with a killer axe. This is the kid's generation now! Why did I let my kid dress up to like Batman? He's got a complex now. I call it the Wayne complex. <laughs> I call the movers. Blood and thunder! Oh, Noir, you delicate little flower. And you know what? To whomever he targets will get the last blow! Now go! Oh, uh, Oh! Anigo can't do crap against him! Aha! Holy cow! Four! See, he did 20 damage where before he would have done 18. Holy cow! What the heck is going on?! That did, that did I should have done no damage! He's almost dead. It's all you. <laughs> it's all you. All right, let's get in noir a bit more action here. Some noir on noir action. I'm with you. Oh snap! Good lord! So much vengeance! Ah! I never knew I was capable of this. And finally, we'll have little Lucina. Just because. You ready? Oh! Aether! Meet Soul, meet Luna. No, oh, but how could this be? My invincible moustache! Blasted science! You have played me for a fool! Now I know what you're thinking. Oh, it's a shame he's gone! He was so cool! He had a mustache! Don't worry, he'll be back. Yarn and Noir were the big heroes here. Hi. Mary, what's fighting? I almost pity the enemies of Elise. Listen. Say, Ray, do you know the way up to the shrine? Right. I, sir, follow me, and let us be quick about it. Kind of adopted a bit of an accent there. Uh, 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 how many stairs are in are in a case of are there in a case of stairs? Because I'm already sick of this stupid staircase. <sighs> the voice truly lives all the way up here. Where are you, Lady Tiki? Are you here? Pray the answer. <sighs> Ah, milady, I'm s I'm so relieved to see you're all right. Um. So you're Lady Tiki, she who speaks for the Divine Dragon. Marth. Marth? Oh, Marmar, -mar, is that you? Huh? My name is Lucina, milady. Though I did go by the name Marth for some for a time. Might uh, might ha uh, we have met? No. Alas, no. I'm sorry. You reminded me of someone I knew, but he is long gone now, lost during my endless sleep. <laughs> You and your father are of, of the exalted bloodline, are you not? Yes. Yes, my lady. Yes. Do you yet possess the fire emblem? It should have been passed down through your family. <sighs> yes, I, yes, I have it. <laughs> ah, what a relief to know how it has not been lost. But where are the gemstones? I only see Argent. Hmm? Gemstones? 
gemstones? Well... Yes, there are five of them. Argent, Sable, Ghoulis, Azure, and Vert. Each holds a portion of Naga's power. When mounted upon the emblem, they allow one to perform the awakening. The rite by which the first exile channeled the Divine Dragon's power. Yes. The very same. With the Fire Emblem's power, the exalt was able to defeat Rima. But such power was too much for men, and so the gemstones were scattered. I kept Azure here with me. Right. My kingdom has safeguarded Vert for generations, but the gem was recently stolen by Wallert's men. Um... Milady, do you know where, where the other two gemstones might be? <sighs> the remaining gemstones, Sable and Ghoulis, are no longer known to me. They may have been taken long ago, at the time of the schism. Alright. Ragnaferox was founded during the schism. As were, uh, at, uh, as were most all nations in the realm, I believe. What? Wait, does that mean the only... You guys have one of the gemstones, Basilio? Uh. Ha! As if anyone would tr entrust the elf with such a thing. Actually, it's true. We did keep one. Ghoulis, did I never inform you? You most certainly did not! <laughs> hmm, must have slipped my mind. Regardless, yes, the West Cons uh, once safeguarded Ghoulis. But it was lost long before my lifetime. Here, take Azure, Exalted Ones. With it, you possess two of the five gemstones. Now you must seek out the others and perform the awakening. Our world must be defended from Grima at all costs. But I'm confused. I thought Grima's power was sealed away. Yes. Yes, but ever since, there have been those who would change that. Grima's life force grows even now, and with it, the sh long shadows of despair. <laughs> when will he return, and where? I cannot know these things, I, but I can feel his presence. It looms closer and closer, closer than you think. This task is a heavy burden, burden. but as he of exalted blo blood, it must fall to you, Krav. Good. I understand. Thank you for all your help. So we have Argent, we have Azure. <laughs> we owe you a great debt, m'lady. Hey. Ah, you. You have it. Huh? What? Listen. You have power like mine. Um... I do? I... Ah, uh, forgive me. I'm still... I am still groggy from my slumber. My words outpace my thoughts. Mm. Are you alright, my lady? Yes. I am fine. Just very tired. I haven't the strength to join you in the fray. Not yet. But I will call the people together in prayer for an end to this conflict. And with that... We have finished up Chapter 16, Naga's Voice. Next time on Fire Emblem Awakening... No. Factions of the Resistance are already uniting in the answer to the Voice's call. See you all then!